Hi guys, welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install VMware Workstation. VMware is a virtualization software, which we use for installing another operating system in our host operating system by creating a virtual PC. Let's get started. First, we need to download VMware Workstation. We can download it from its website. I have given you link in the description below. VMware Workstation has two editions. The first one is Pro, and second is Player. VMware Workstation Pro is used for workplaces, but it is a bit expensive, and we can only use it for free on a 30 days free trial. VMware Workstation Player, on the other hand, we can be used for non-commercial uses, and it is free. So, here, I'm going to download VMware Workstation Player. Click on Go to Downloads. Here, we can download it for Windows and Linux. Download according to your operating system. I'm going to download it for Windows. Click on the Download button. After downloading, go to the downloaded location. To run the virtual machines in our system, we need to enable the virtualization technology in our BIOS. Let me show you how to do it. We will need to restart our system to go in the BIOS settings. The moment systems reboot, we will need to press our BIOS key continuously. Every system has its BIOS key, as you can see on the screen. In the BIOS settings, go to System Configuration. Here, we can see Virtualization Technology. Enable it. Then, press F10 and hit Enter to save the changes. System will reboot automatically. Now, run the VMware setup. On Setup Wizard, click Next. Accept the license and click on Next. Again, Next. Here, we can uncheck these things if we want. Click on Next. Again, Next. Then, install it. It has been installed. Click on Finish. Go to Desktop. Here, we can see VMware Workstation. Open it. On the Welcome Wizard, it gives us some options. We will go with the first one option. It is for non-commercial use, and it is free. If we go with commercial use, then we will need to buy license for it. Click on Continue, and finish it. Here, we can create a new virtual machine for any operating system. As we can see here, I have already created a Windows 10 virtual machine. But, I moved the virtual machine from its original location. So, VMware is unable to find it. Let me remove it. Here, we can create a new virtual machine, or open an existing virtual machine by clicking on it. For creating a new virtual machine, click on Create a new virtual machine. New virtual machine wizard appears. Here, select the installation media like ISO file. We can also insert installation media after creating the virtual machine. Click Next. Here, operating system will be automatically selected if we put installation media. Or we can manually select it. Click Next. Here, we can change the virtual machine's name or location. Click Next. Here, we set up the disk size. Click on Next. Now, virtual machine is ready, and we can also customize hardware according to our requirements. Thank you guys for watching our video. Give us a like if you like it, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for new videos.